Owens in the ring. Kevin Owens is... All right, that's enough of that. Has it occurred to anybody else that Prince Harry looks a lot like me? <laughs> and you know, from what I hear, uh... From what I hear, he's, uh, quite a big fan of mine. More so than, let's say, oh, I don't know, um, Bobby Lashley. Mr. Bobby Lashley, Mr. Jacked Up, Mr. Intense, Mr. Dominant, leaves WWE for 10 years, decides to make his big return to Raw on the very same night that I returned to Raw. And you know what? To his credit, he comes back looking like a million bucks. He tries to make an impact, and that's all well and good. The only problem is he tried to do it at my expense. All right, take a look at this. No, you didn't. Well, it's okay, because I'll tell you what the effect it had on me was, okay? Because of that right there, I contracted vertigo. That's right. The first ever documented case of vertigo in WWE history. Oh, you think that's funny? That's funny to you? Yeah? You know who doesn't think it's funny? Uh, uh, my doctor. Yeah, yeah, that's who, okay? I happen to have a little note right here. debilitating condition that affects one's balance and motor skills. I mean, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. That's the reason why I couldn't compete in the greatest Royal Rumble match, a match I would have won. That's why last week I lost my Money in the Bank qualifying match, a match I should have won. That's why I have lost every single match that I've been in since that incident, and it's all because Bobby Lashley targeted me. Bobby Lashley victimized me. And he did it all to impress you? Oh my goodness. It's disgusting. And it's actually working is the worst part, okay? He's getting cheered. He's getting all this buzz. He's getting notoriety. He's getting special treatment. Just last week, just last week, he sat down to a super exclusive interview with Renee Young. After a 10 year this guy, this guy had something to hide. So I used a little tool at my disposable that I like to call Facebook. And I reached out to Bobby Lashley's three sisters and boy, oh boy, did they have a story to tell. That's right, these three lovely ladies were nothing like Bobby Lashley described them to be. And from what they tell me, Bobby Lashley isn't exactly the person that he portrays himself to be either. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. But you know what, it's fine. Hey, don't take my word for it. You can ask his sisters. That's right, because I have invited his sisters next week to appear on Raw, Jessica. Francis, Kathy, and with his sisters in attendance, I promise I will expose the real Bobby Lashley. That's gonna be interesting.